What's up guys, it's Drew, uh, Lefty NDV, coming back at you with a extremely, extremely frustrating mail day. Um, not one, but two eBay douchebags for the win. Um, oh, just absolute headaches. Uh, one absolute fraud type situation, so I'll let you guys be the judge. Before I ruin my mood uh, even worse, I'm just going to show off a couple pickups. Uh, this first one I was very excited to get from my Chipper Jones collection. It's from 98 Flair Showcase. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the Legacy Collection. Look at that card pop. Number 200. If you guys were collecting back in the day, you know how tough these were to get. And thank God I only collect the guys as expensive as Chipper. Uh, if I was like Chad and collected Griffey, this card would cost me two or three hundred dollars. Um... The next four cards I got are all on-card pickups. Uh, this first one is from 2001, Fleer Greats of the Game, or Fleer Greats, Brooks Robinson. There we go. Nice on-card autograph. Uh, the next one from a 2013 uh, Topps 5 Star, Jim Rice. What up, Sictifer? Love that card. Had to get one of him. Uh, this one I got for like five bucks. Walked in the shop. Couldn't pass. Or no, excuse me, not this one. The next one. Uh, I did get this one for five bucks, but that's 2013 tops tier one. Don Sutton number two two ninety nine. And this card walked in the shop. Could not pass it up. Got it for ten bucks. Uh, I don't even know what year this is. Two thousand one upper deck something subway heroes. Our Subway Series heroes, Whitey Ford, and that is number to 450. First Whitey Ford autograph, so absolute beauty there. Um, then before I get into the two eBay douchebags, uh, just a little shameless plug. Uh, I do sell cards on eBay every now and then when I want to fund something else or whatever, and also sell for a good friend of mine. Um, so I'm just going to show some of those off. They are ending tonight. Uh, this first one, that scratches on the case. Uh, Michael Jordan, one of one, auto from All Time Greats. Just a beautiful card. Absolutely killer. Uh, this one ends in a couple days, actually, I lied. Uh, if you like soccer, Maynard Figueroa, Prism, one of one, Honduras. Uh, this one ends tonight. Uh, it's These come out of the Panini Black Boxes. This is the Green Select LeBron. 9-5, numbered 7 out of 10, and just some vintage stuff, um, 55 Pee Wee Reese, PSA 7, Bowman, a T206 Huey Jennings, PSA 3, that has a polar bear back, uh, a 1933 Gaudi, excellent 5, this is a beautiful card, uh, Joe Cronin, and a Rick Farrell. Also a 33 Gaudi 5. Those end in a few days. Um, I got a couple stuff ending tonight. A few cards. Got this Mike Stanton Auto ending in a few hours from 08 Donner's Threads. Check it out. Now, on to the eBay douchebags. Um, the first one, not too upset about. I mean, it was, it's whatever. I, actually, it got here okay. Uh, it was the guy I bought this from. PWE, it was not in Magnetic. That's all me. Um, so, dudes, don't don't send in PWE unless you're gonna give me free shipping and tell me so. You know, if I pay three dollars for shipping, the least you could do is put it in a bubble mailer. Uh, now on to the um, people like this absolutely kill me. What up, watch the list. Um, okay, this card right here. As you can see, I paid sixty-two dollars for this card. Well. Thought this card. All right, read the title. What does that say? It says 1958 tops Warren Spawn um, PSA seven. Click on the picture. Okay. What does that look like to you? As you can see, the case is. There's a PSA case on the card. I'll turn that light off. 
Um, sorry for the glare. Anyways, as you can clearly see, this card along the edges here, there was a PSA case. I don't, I don't think you guys can pick it up. Um, you know, graded, says, says clearly PSA 7. Clearly says that. Um, I get this in my mailbox. So I'm thinking, you know, what is up with this? As I'm opening it, this is the card that I get. In this top load, no penny sleeve. Now you tell me. Is that that card? Because I don't think so. So what do I do? I send this guy a message, you know, I open a case. Uh, let's see. Bear with me, guys. Case opened. So I send this guy a message. I'm like, hey, clearly not this card. You know, you, you know what? It, what are you trying to pull here? Um, clearly said it was graded in the title. And this is what the idiot replies with. Item picture is what I did send you. I annotated that the card was not graded. Not sure what you wanted. Please do return the card for a full refund. No, you are a moron. PSA 7 near mint. Ladies and gentlemen, please avoid San Diego 1476. This guy is clearly a moron. Oh, just a hassle. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys. eBay douchebags for the win.